to complete this obstacle. Where is Joe? Absolutely love watching this guy compete. He's got 17 years as a gymnast, got that experience, that body awareness, air awareness, transitioned into Ninja, and just fell in love with this sport. He's been doing great things for the community. Here he goes now on the Lachey lanes. Seen the work he's done with his students, a lot of great techniques and progression style training. Very important to do with those students at an early age. Joe, great coach, making sure. Oh, he's making skips when he can. <laughs> Gets the thumbs up. Nice job. Saw a couple athletes do that this morning. It made it look pretty casual there. Oh, great catch on the rope. Plenty of hang time there. See some of that gymnast tech coming into play. Ooh, keep those toes up. Think he's good. The one thing I do love that you said, I, I have seen him do like drill work with his students. Um, which I think is really great. He likes to break things down, go through the motions. How do you align your hips? Speaking of that hip swing, just able to swing on through off that steering wheel for a clean dismount thus far. No errors yet. Trying to keep that going with a smile on his face, looking relaxed out there. Having a good time. Let's see how he does on these tiny cliffs. Going for the match tech. I'm, I am surprised he's not doing the 180 tech here. There's not a lot of room. Bump it. Okay, good. You hear the crowd start popping off a little bit for him. <laughs> wants to give him some support. There's a little bit of a breather on the pillar there. and Gets it through. About a minute and a half to go for Mr. Joe Capo. Well, like I said, it's, it's always been fun testing uh, with Joe. He has competed a couple times on American Ninja Warrior, but... I really can't understate, I mean, how consistent this guy is at testing. He, he almost always stays dry. Ugh, not able to get tough, it there. Tough move here. It's different than your typical skyhook transition. you got to engage that clasp on the Pac-Man hold. You'll be able to push forwards and then pull it back to engage it. A new move here. Second try. Hold tight. Gets the thumbs up there. Nice, and that slots him into fourth place. Puts Xavier on the bubble. Yeah, here we go, final obstacle here. He's got so much time if he can just be patient here, get through this slider. Watch those corners. With only one fall, I mean, this would put him into second place, which would be a great spot to be in. I've got the Sasuke-style dismount here with a sliding bar. Overhead, it makes it really tough to try to get a good dismount. And the power required. Oh, just shy of the dismount here. He's going to have to retry with. It. He's going to have about 10 seconds. It's going to be tight. Oh, come on. Yeah. Oh, he rushed it and not able to get there with the time allotted. But Joe, great run thus far. Puts him in fourth. Yeah, had to go for it there. But we do have a special guest commentator for you guys. We are joined by the commentator ninja. Mary Layton will be taking over, so I'm going to hand over the mic and uh, 